today we are doing what we here at the Ronald call whippy coffee, but I believe the technical term is Daldona coffee. Uh, it's, this is another thing that's been trending and, uh, and everybody has been making it, and so I figured why not make this too, right? Plus, um, this has become, we have been making this at the house, this has become a, kind of a staple um, an everyday thing. So, I'm making it for myself and my friends. So what you're going to start out with, and I did a clear rule because I want you guys to see um, from all angles. I want you to see the volume, all that good stuff. So what you're going to do, uh, you're going to take instant coffee. And for five people, I am doing three tablespoons. So I'm going a little heavier. If you want to do it just for yourself, do one teaspoon. And this is gonna be equal parts, so we are going to do equal parts sugar. So we're gonna do three tablespoons of sugar. And lastly, we are going to do three tablespoons of hot water. That looks good. 
that that uh, means the air is pre uh, being treated or happening. So my peaks, um, if you've ever whipped egg whites before um, or anything along those lines, you have like stiff peaks, medium peaks. These are stiff peaks. When you turn them over, they stand right up. We want that. That's great. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to serve the non-mocha one and then I'm going to add in the cocoa powder and then I'm going to make the rest of them mocha. So what I have here is I have a glass with ice in it. We're going to take our Hartzler milk. So fun fact, Hartzler donates milk to us. They are um, an amazing dairy up in Worcester. Um, they donate their milk and it is, it is so, so good. So we thank them for that. So I'm going to go about three quarters of the way. And then how you serve it. Then what you can do is you can take your spoon and you can mix it in. So that's just the regular ones. Now what I'm going to do, scrape my sides. And add in a little bit of cocoa powder to make it mocha. I remember in culinary school, I had a chef, Chef Straub. He, uh, when he talked about mocha, he was like, mocha is the flavors of chocolate and coffee together. That is a mocha. And he's like, so whenever there is somebody saying, oh, I'll have chocolate with my mocha, the chocolate's already in there. <laughs> so whenever you see mocha or a true mocha, it should be coffee with chocolate. milk or soy milk you can definitely do that um, if you want to do caramel you can do caramel I love caramel so uh, I wouldn't see why not on that Divide and conquer with this. 